I'm Dina Fisher. I'm the artist who's done all of the artwork. I've been working for about a year on this project. I live in the foothills of Los Angeles where the city kisses wilderness. This project in particular speaks a lot to my personal experience. My family is mixed and my mother was kind of like a forebearer of um, desegregation herself. The importance is to make sure that the maverick women of the Denton Women's Interracial Fellowship, their work is remembered to honor them and for the next generation to have a place to come and learn about the legacy of what they did. This I call the image curtain, and it's designed to be viewed from both sides. There's an image on each side of these discs. So all together, we have many, many images here. This was during the 1960s civil rights movement. So this tells the story of the days when the women were active in the fellowship, but it also gives the background. My hopes are that I get to hang out with the women because I'm really impressed by their spirit and also celebrate the journey that I've been on for the last year. And I'm gonna make a huge sigh of relief <laughs> when the unveiling happens and I actually turn the artwork over to the public. today who were in the fellowship. You did amazing work and you touched the lives of so many people, including me. Thank you very much to each and every one of you. And I have to say, like that's just indicative of how warm and friendly and wonderful everybody has been here. So I've fallen in love with Denton. The president signed uh, the proclamation that the schools would be integrated. The Christian women of the city of Denton, the, the white and black, came together and we organized this group and we got together. And most important thing though, Southeast Denton streets were not paid. Some of the ladies would get together and go downtown at the hotels and the restaurants, walk the streets and get signatures. I think it's a blessing that so many of us are still here. It'll be an everlasting part that the people will see and understand that we came together as a race and we really became as one. 